So over here you can see that I have a project and let's say what you want to do is you want to resize out this particular uh, design into a different aspect ratio. In that case you can go around over here and click on the uh, uh, name of the project right here and you can see that resize is an option and once you do uh, that what happens is that you can go around and choose different resize options that you have right here. Let me just go around and click on show all and you can see that you have different uh, presets of resizing right here just like this. Let me just go around over here and choose create a custom size right here and let's just go around and keep it around over here in 600 right here and click on continue. So once you do that, you can see that this is what you have. So this is the uh, original project and you can see that it resized everything out right here and it, uh, and it detects out the objects and tries to resize it so that the design is not affected. So I'm just going to go around and resize this in new file right here. So you can make a copy of the file right here, just like this. And what happens is that you get a new resized version of the project just like this over here. So you can see that this is with the new aspect ratio and new resolution. Let me just go around over here and then click on resize over here once more. And if I were to click on show all right here, you can see that um, uh, I can select out another paper size as well and click on continue over here. And what happens is that the file will be resized right here. So I'm just going to go around over here and resize this into new file as well. And what happens is that uh, everything will be resized over here just like this as you can see. So this is what you have and you can go around and re um, um, uh, just rearrange everything out right here just like this. And then this is what you have. So let's just go around and sometimes when you resize you don't really have the best layout right here just like this. So let's just go around and pull this out. And then I'm going to go around and pull it out right here and then pull uh, this object over here as well. And then this is how you resize it. So that is how you can go around and resize out projects inside of Microsoft Designer. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.